Hi everyone and welcome to Real Thing Technology YouTube channel. Today we are diving into the fast easy tutorial on setting of one stake in moment. If you are new to full stake development or just want to refresh stake around some helpful steps, let's get started. First things first, let's cover what MUN stands for. MUN is short for MongoDB and uh, Express, React and Node.js. Together this technology lets you build full stack applications using only JavaScript, one of the most popular languages today. To start, we will need Node.js and npm installed. If you don't have this here, visit Node.js official website. Here you can see the Node.js link, click on it. Download the installer and run it. This will also give us npm which we will use to install the rest of our packages. So follow the all steps to install the node.js. Once you complete the installation process, here you can see Node.js is installed in your system. Next, let's install the MongoDB. You can download the MongoDB community server from the MongoDB website. Here you can see the link. Click on it. Now here you can see the download options. Click on it and follow the setup instructions. installed make sure it's running now let's set up our project folder create a new folder here i take the name mern stack and open it in your code editor here i open the vs code editor We will use the terminal to initialize our Node.js app by running npm in it. Let's install the required packages. We will need Express for our backend and Mongoose for our MongoDB integration. Run npm install Express Mongoose in your terminal. Once it's installed, ins install Express Packages 2.
Finally, let's set up the basic server. In your project folder, create a new file called index.js. Add the code to import the express, create an app and listen on a specified port. This will be our starting point for the building an app. Here is the const express equal to required express. This line imports the express modules, a popular web framework for the Node.js. We simplify the building web servers and handling HTTP request. Okay. By importing the express, we get the access to its functionalities and can create the servers with as. Now, const app equal to express. This line initializes the new express applications by calling express. The app variable now represents your web applications and you can use it to set up the routes, URL path and handle HTTP request and more. Now, const port equal to process dot env dot port 5500 this line defines a variable port to determine which port the server should listen on here app dot get slash comma request comma rail and here res dot send welcome to Real thing technology one man tutorial. Here app.get slash set of the route for the routes URL. And this means when the user visit HTTP localhost 5000 your server URL, this route will be handle the request. Request comma raise. This line is the callback functions that get executed when someone visit the route. Request uh, request put the information about the incoming request will uh, raise raise is basically response it is used to send the data back to the client and raise dot send is send a response back to the client in this case it is a simple message okay welcome to this real thing technology month tutorial this text will be display the page when someone assess this route here app.listen port here is the console.log server running on port and dollar dollar and the port here app.listen port start the server on the specified port and console.log this is a callback function runs once the server successfully starts login login a message to a console that says the server is running and so the port number this is useful for the confirming that the server is off to running expected once you run this code and visit httpp local host 5500 in your browser you should see welcome to real thing technology one tutorial display and that's it you have set up basic money stack environment in the upcoming videos we will deep deeper into building applications with mongodb express react and node.js if you found this helpful okay please like subscribe and hit the notification bell so you don't miss any real thing technology future tutorials